All right, guys, Gua Galangi here in Jarantut. We actually had no intention of coming here. We just arrived in Jarantut yesterday. We were checking in at the hotel, and the guy who works at the hotel says, Hey, I know you from YouTube. Let me take you around Jarantut. We can go to a cave and we can go to a waterfall. So like, cute. amazing. So, his name is Ami. He does not want to be in the video. He's shy of the camera. So, uh, you won't see him in the video, but you'll definitely see him in our hearts. Nice guy, <laughs> Ami, taking us around today. Very similar to what happened with Wen Ramla, if you remember from our past videos. Just a local who wants to put us in their car and drive us around and show us some stuff. Yeah. So we actually drove in Ami's car through this cave a second ago. From kind of town, it's about 20 minutes ride by car. 20 minutes ride mm -hmm. by car, and then we drove on a nice forest road and drove right through the cave, which was really incredible. And here we are in Gua Galangi. Mm -hmm. So maybe guys, go to the comments and write, thank you, Ami. His name is Ami, A-M-Y. He doesn't want to be in the video, so we can't thank him in the video, but go to the comments and write, thank you, Ami. You're a nice guy, Ami. <laughs> Something about Ami, because super nice. Here we are in Gua Galangi on, yeah. uh, you know, no plan, just a local says, come with me. We got so, some monkeys greeting us. Mm, monkeys earlier. greeting us too. <laughs> Should be a good day today. Look at this. Cool, let's Look go. At this. I'm kind of loving how this is kind of like half cave, half open air because my experience with caves is they're always damp and you get wet. So I'm sure there'll be a damp part coming up, but hopefully we can do it towards the end of the uh, cave section so we're not sticky and gross for the whole thing. But so far so good, it's massive in here. Lots to look at. It's like a jungle gym or a playground for adults. For a guy like me who's kind of inherently immature, fun to climb around and see what I can get up to in this place. Pretty great. Woo! So I guess these caves are limestone caves. They're sort of like a limestone, almost like a mountain or a hill kind of jutting out of the earth. And it's covered in jungle stuff. So that's why there's monkeys around. And I guess all around the limestone is just farms, which is kind of picturesque from up above. But uh, the limestone really stands out as the only thing going vertical in the whole landscape here. So I'm pretty excited to go check out these caves. Okay, let's do it. All right guys, evidently there's many, many more caves to see here. So we'll go see more and more caves today. We'll see what we can see. Maybe we can find some bats. Maybe we can find some more monkeys. Maybe we can find Ooh, some we'll see what interesting we can find. things in the caves. And after that, a waterfall. What a great day. Okay, let's go. Oh, this one is much more, got me feeling like Indiana Jones. Big staircase on the way up. And then a nice dark and dun 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 dun. There's treasure in there somewhere. Probably a monster too, Ivana. Da -da. Ivana, do it. Echo! Yell, Ivana! Echo! Yell! Dead! Uh, Ivana can't yell! Ivana can't yell! I'll show you how to yell. Hello. Oh, pretty good, pretty good. I'll show you how to yell, Come on, guys. Echo! Echo! That's how you yell, Ivana. Come on. I got the big voice, eh? <laughs> what is this? This looks like it's man-made. Oh, does it? What the heck is happening here? Is this stone useful and they're taking it? Like it's limestone or something? I don't know. These cuts look like somebody cut into it. No idea. What a mystery. I mean, it's got to be man-made. This perfectly rectangular cut. Interesting. What's that, Ivana? Is that garbage? Or is that a mushroom? I don't know. Don't touch it. <laughs> Whoa, what's this? Should I touch it? No. Ivana, that's a mushroom. Don't touch it. Ivana, hold the hold light. Are you going to bite me? Don't. Don't touch it? No. What is it? Oh, that was you. <laughs> oh, that was you. You tricked me. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, it's a pig. What is it? Anyway, too many things we have no answers for in the caves. Yeah. Always mysteries in the caves. Okay, Ivana, you want to go? Because I'm covered in sweat. Yeah. Okay. Really? Oh, you are too. Look at your back. Okay, guys. On to the next cave. On to the next adventure. Okay. A little bit of a... To get here, a little bit of a stair climb. 
Oh, this one looks spooky, Vanna. Dun dun dun. Uh. Oh, I feel like I'm entering some sort of dungeon, right? You're smart, you read the signs. I never read the signs. Gross, man. Oof, this is a real cave experience. This is the, the most intense cave experience of my life. No, Ivana? Because it's, no one's been here in so long, it's so much more cave. Bats. I saw three bats falling, Ivana. Oh my gosh, I want to go home and have a shower right now. I feel so dirty. From Campoon Boy to Jungle Boy to Cave Dweller. Oh, jeez. Oh my god, that almost hit me in the head. Ah! This is uh, very interesting. What is this? This is a little doorway. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Bro, that is a huge snake! That thing is two meters long! Poisonous or no? I mean venomous. White snake. Venomous or no? No, it's a white snake. White snake. Dude! Oh, this is so gross, there's bugs in my ear. This is the most intense cave experience in my life. Okay, let's go back! No, Ivana, press on. <laughs> oh, he's moving. Oh, he's turning at me. Look at him. He says, "Hey, you. I don't like Canadians, man." <laughs> okay, I'm fine. Oh, snakes are so gross. <laughs> Look at this boy. <laughs> I got bugs in my face. Hey, bro. I'm cool. So you're certain he's not gonna bite me? It will. But it's not poisonous. Uh, venomous. Yeah. Whoa. Very interesting. Look at the way the snakes move. They're just so disgusting. Big. Oh, gross. Look at him. Look at his tongue. His tongue is forked. He's licking the spider web. He's probably stealing their food. He's probably a thief. Snakes are dishonest. Oh. Okay, Ivana, come on. Don't be scared. No. Come on, hold my hand. I'll, I'll guard you. No, oh, no, oh. Facing at me, facing at me. Go back? Okay, we go back. Look at him. Look at him. Oh, so gross. Okay, bye, snake. <laughs> Trip ruiner. <laughs> wow. <sighs> Ivana, tell me your uh, cave experience. Ah! Okay? Snakes and spiders. <laughs> <laughs> and bats. Wow. Okay. okay, backwards. We are cowards, Ivana. We gave up on the journey. <laughs> as soon as I saw that snake, I'm like, no way I'm continuing going down that cave. <sighs> we had to abandon it and we came back to where we came. Oh. Oh. Ivana scared us. Feels so icky in oh. there. Okay, one more cave. Elephant cave, they call it. Okay, let's go. Hopefully no snakes. If you see an elephant, will you be scared? No. Okay, they have it. <laughs> elephant cave. Whoa, guys. On the way to Elephant Cave. Look at the size of this tree. Poo! Gotta be a tour long tree too, no? I think so. Almost like the one in uh, Tamanagara. So Jeez. strong. Look it's just that. amazing to be around a tree this big, isn't it? Poof! Okay, next up, Elephant Cave. All right, we're caving again. I bet you the reason it's called Elephant Cave, some of these stalagmites are gonna look like elephants eventually. I've seen that before in other 
caves in other countries. And actually, I think in Perak too. Those hanging things. Oh, we got bats again. Lots of bats. Lots of bats, Steve. Oh, 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 oh. Are they sleeping? Oh my gosh. How'd you do that? Because snakes eat bats. So if you act like a snake, they run away. That's so funny. There's tons of bats here. Oh my gosh. Tons and tons and tons of bats. Hoof. Steve, now do you know? You see why? There's your elephant. <laughs> I knew it. The stalagmite looks like... And someone drew eyes on it. Perfect. Elephant cave. There you have it. Hoof. Too many bats, man. I don't know about you guys, but I'm scared of bats. Oh my gosh. Oh, they were, I thought they were sleeping all day. Not these bats. Oh my gosh. Oof. Okay, I think we're almost there. Ami says we're going towards the Mona Lisa. So, can't miss it. Slowly but surely. Okay. Safe. Come on down, Ivana. Good job, Ivana. You made it. No problem. Easy peasy. <laughs> Way up there, can you see? The Mona Lisa. There you have it. I feel like it's a bit of a letdown. We came all the way for this. But that's okay, it's, it's the Mona Lisa. There you have it. <laughs> okay, there you have it. It's kind of nice, no? Oh. And from what I understand, guys, there's a lot more caves here than just the three we saw. So you could spend a whole day here if you're coming to Jarantut. I think Jarantut might be a nice place to add on to your uh, Tamanagara trip, actually. Lots to do, lots to see, lots of action. I cannot wait for the waterfall. I feel like I need to shower. Caves are damp and sweaty and bats and oh, I cannot wait to see if I can go swimming at the waterfall. So, let's go. So out of the jungle we head through a rubber plantation and we drove through the old town of Jarantut which was quite picturesque and it's where we went for lunch as well as where we went for dinner. And we ended up driving through something very interesting. We had a really enjoyable experience driving through an Orang Asli village. Now you guys know we stayed with an Orang Asli village last week, but that was a very traditional village. No electricity and no cars, no technology, nothing. This village is much more modern. You see Orang Asli owning cars and owning motorcycles. They seem to live mostly in these wood houses. And it's my understanding that they were offered some government assistance to upgrade their house and kind of move away from the farms but they preferred this lifestyle living mostly as farmers with wooden houses very simple it's just a different lifestyle it's kind of their belief system puts them in this position where they'd much rather stay living in a wooden house working on a farm kind of a simple life this house here super picturesque so there you have it we were quite interested in driving through i wish we could have gotten out of the car and went and talked to some people but we're too shy to do that but we had a really great experience as per usual with the road trips in malaysia the unscheduled stops seem to be the most interesting and with that we were at the waterfall all right guys we've made it to the waterfall here we are look at this beautiful view in front of us ready to go swimming so on the way here we had some lunch yeah we stopped for uh, some nice chicken and rice at a mm -hmm. very nice restaurant, but I wasn't really full after lunch, you know? I just right. wanted a little bit more food. I wasn't really full. Mm -hmm. So just as we were walking here, we parked the car, we were walking through the jungle, and we had a little snack. I can eat this. This the is the butt food. of the ant. It's still alive in my hand, oh. and they're telling me I can eat it right now. What does okay. it taste like? Sour. Sour. Just bite it off. Safe. Yes. Where is it? I didn't get it. Tastes good actually. Really? Tastes like candy. I'm no. not gonna lie, it tastes like candy. I'm trying. I got it, look, it's dead, it's gone. I took off half its body. Oh, uh... Ivana, it tastes like candy. You wanna try? I want to try that. He's got one more. He's got one more. No, I'm serious. It's just a candy. I'm just... serious. <laughs> so eat the tail. Eat the brown part.
Wow, it is sour. It's good, right? It's like, um, you know, um, lime. Yeah. Like a little bit of that pocket of lime. Yes. Wow. It's good. <laughs> what? That's why you travel with a local. Oh. You can eat ants off the jungle floor. Wow. It's good. And now I think it's time to go swimming. I'm telling you, is there anything better than the noise of a waterfall? Is there any better sound in the jungle than the music of the waterfall? It's powerful, it's relaxing, it's meditation, it's beautiful, it's everything all at once. Here I am with my new friend of me. Come on. Swimming, swimming, baby. <laughs> How's the water? I didn't even get it. Ryan didn't go lame -o. I was having too much fun flying the drone. Flying the drone. Yeah. There you have it. Let's be honest. The water is perfect temperature. Very refreshing. It's a little bit rocky on your feet, but it's beautiful. There's wild dogs kind of running around. <laughs> We just ate some ants. What could be better than this, Ivana? Oh, ants. Ooh. What could be better than this? Okay, next stop, I think we'll explore a little more around here. Mm -hmm. So some more beautiful nature coming your way. <laughs> oh my God, did you guys see that? Hornbill, hornbill. Wow, guys, hornbills, wow. bats, spiders, and snakes. My favorite was the hornbills. I think so. The ants, they're not bad too. They actually taste and good. And ants, I forgot about the they ants. They taste good. Wow, what a day. Today reminds me of a day that we would have with a jeep, a bunga jeep. Right. A local just taking us around. We have tons of great experiences. So we just came to a golf course. You can see we're at a golf course. Woo just what we thought it would be a nice spot to chill and relax, sit under a tree. And then Ivana was running with the camera in her hand like a mad lady <laughs> looking for the hornbills. <laughs> Ami saw them and I was flying the drone and Ivana was like, gone, Ivana's sprinting. So I got a nice shot of Ivana sprinting. I wish I got a better camera. Wow. Yeah, the lens is the wrong lens. We can't zoom we with this lens. We need to buy a zoom a lens. Zoom lens. That's All our we, next yeah. purchase. All we have is the wide angle for the vlogging. <laughs> Next purchase, zoom lens. Wow, Ivana, what a great day we're having. I think mm -hmm. we're gonna go swimming in one more spot and then we can Ooh. go for some dinner. All right. It's only like 4 p.m. I've done enough for like four days today. Yeah, wow. I'm having fun today. Seriously, guys, go to the comments and write, you're the best, Ami, thank you, Ami, uh, Malaysian <laughs> hospitality, Ami, because what an amazing guy. We just checked into the hotel and he's like, I'll take you out tomorrow. What time do you want to get picked up? I'm like, I don't know, 10 a.m., boom. And now we look at this plan. <laughs> right. So, uh, oh, look at this, I'm on the green. I love this field. <laughs> Walking across a golf course. I guess it's out of business or no one's here. I don't know. COVID-19? Yeah, I think it's because of COVID. I mean, it looks pretty nice. I think the grass is trimmed right. pretty well. Looks nice, but empty. It's well kept. It's well kept. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's keep exploring. What a great day, guys. Come on. Clam digging all over again, Ivana. Looking for Lokan. Looking for Lokan here. <laughs> okay, it looks pretty nice here. It was a bit of a walk to get here, okay, but we're here now, so let's uh, let's go in our little jacuzzi stream here. Come on, what could be better? It's cold. There you have it, guys. We made it. <laughs> 
How is the water, Steve? It's nice, refreshing. I'm washing my legs. All right. Come on, what could be better? Cool, man. Okay, guys, something exciting here. A me found some rocks that uh, almost like clay. They look like uh, or like water pastel or watercolors. Watercolors, so you can paint on people. Do I look cool? What does it say? Do I look cool? Mm -hmm. Do you look fierce? Oh yeah. Which island are you from? Uh, I'm from a small island just north of America. It's called Canada. <laughs> Do they look cool, Nevada? Yeah, man. Does it come off with water? Or is it permanent? Tattoo? <laughs> face tattoo? Permanent face tattoo, nice one. So our friend Amy is taking over. Ivana was uh, trying to write jet lag warriors on my forehead. <laughs> so don't write that. <laughs> Make it look cool. Make it look cool. I like thought a, you said write jet lag warriors, but you said make me look like, like a warrior. warrior. Wow. Do I look cool? Should I do some should I do some warrior moves? Oh my gosh, my foot's asleep. I can't stand up. <laughs> What's a Maori thing? Do I look cool? Oh. Do I look cool? Yeah, from warrior to balsa. Well, that's, that's a modern day warrior. UFC. Cool, my man. foot's asleep and I can't walk. <laughs> I'm stuck here, my face is brown. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, cool. I was asleep, I can't walk. Okay, here we go, I'm walking again. Like your necklace, come on. Oh, the necklace too, come on. I'm this close to being Malaysian, you know that, eh? <laughs> so, from Kampung boy to jungle boy to, to tribal. Warrior. Tribal warrior. My warrior. foot is still half asleep, guys. I'm going to fall <laughs> over. Oh, tingling! There you go. There you go. Thumbnail. Oh. Eee, jungle day, jungle day. Oh my gosh, my foot is tingling. I'm gonna fall over. Oh. Oh. Look fierce, look fierce. <sighs> oh, 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 you look like a tiger. I'm a jungle man. Let me see how this works. You just go like this and then it colors. Oh, that's how you do it. Yeah. No artificial colors, guys. All natural. It's from a rock. My foot is asleep so hard. Oh. Okay, now I gotta try to wash this off my face, maybe over here. And then we're gonna go munch some roti chennai. They're trying to convince me to wear this to roti chennai, which is not gonna happen, guys. <laughs> Simply no, not ever, not once. <laughs> what a day, guys, seriously. Think about all the things we did today, Ivana. Three caves, including a big snake, waterfall, including eating ants, seeing some orang asli in a village and then uh, coming here and painting our faces like uh, warriors. So we've begun the long trek in ankle high water to the car, but uh, totally worth it today. Seriously guys, get to the comments and say special thanks to Ami. He did not want to be on the video. He was really serious about that. <laughs> but uh, he's a really great guy, really great help. Very knowledgeable and had a great time with him today. What was your highlight? Highlight for me, might be eating the ants, which yeah. is pretty amazing. That was a, is that what yours is? Yeah. Really? Yeah. It was actually yummy. It was it was surprising. Unbelievable that it tastes yummy. I would eat it right now. I would eat five of them right now. Um, really nice. Also seeing the big snake was really cool. Oh yeah. Orang Asli Village was really cool. Mm-hmm. Everything. Five star. The most important thing of the day was getting to know Ami, making a new Malaysian friend. Yeah. There you have it, guys. New friends in Malaysia. More friends in Malaysia. What could be better than that? All right, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. We got lots of good stuff coming from uh, Malaysia and beyond. We're looking into our next country. It might be East Malaysia. It might be Turkey. Maybe cast your vote in the comments below if you want to see where we're going next. Also, stay tuned. In one of our upcoming videos, there'll be a secret word for a t-shirt giveaway. Say bye to everybody, Ivana. Love you guys. Bye. Subscribe, please.